From Wastelanders to Steel Dawn, Seasons to a Colossal Problem, and One Wasteland to Shelters, Fallout 76 underwent a lot of changes in 2020, and we are looking forward to keeping up with that momentum in 2021. We cannot wait to share more information with you as to all updates to Fallout 76 arriving later this year. But as for the immediate future, let us chat about something we are calling the Inventory Update. January 26 marks the date of this brand new update to Fallout 76, which, as you could guess, includes several quality of life changes specifically revolving around how you manage your inventory and stash within the game. First and foremost, we are planning to increase the stash limit from 800 to a maximum of 1200 pounds. Whether it be weapons, armor, junk, meds or otherwise, we hope that this 50% increase will assist you in your inventory management needs. Looking towards the Pip Boy, we are making it easier for you to find the items that you desire by adding three new tabs to the Pip Boy menu New, Armor, and Food Slash Drink. New will keep track of all the items you gather during your current play session, sorted by newest to oldest, so that you can easily identify the new items you have just collected. As for armor, we are splitting armor pieces into their own menu tab, so that they are separated from other apparel such as outfits. Lastly, food slash drink will now collate all your food and drink items away from chems and serums, which will remain in your aid tab. Then we come to stack weight. Items such as ammo, chems and food can be collected together in large quantities and quickly add up to a lot of weight. After this update, whenever you select any stackable item in your inventory, its item details will show the total weight of that stack in addition to the weight of the individual items. This, therefore, allows you to quickly determine how much space those items are actually taking up as a whole. Finally, let us chat about vending machines. A requested feature from the community has been the ability to more easily determine certain items that other players have for sale in their vending machines, such as legendary items, without needing to travel to a camp first. With the inventory update, we are providing you with new previews of player vending machines when examining them from the map. These previews will show you the exact number of 1, 2, and 3 star legendary weapons and armor up for sale, in addition to the existing categories like regular weapons, armor, ammo, and meds. Moreover, empty categories will no longer be displayed in these new previews. And do not forget, Fallout 76 is still receiving a range of new in-game content and events, such as the recently begun Season 3 with KD Inkwell, Fashion Not Day, and even new script surplus weekends, which will increase the the amount of script that you can trade for in a single day. We will announce the specific dates for in-game events occurring in 2021 via the Fallout website and our social channels. So please leave your thoughts in the comments below and keep an eye out for more video updates throughout this year. At Victorium.